Hey. Feraldra, dude. Is that the stupid one or the smart one? That's the stupid one. She's called AV. She has zero uh, IQ. Sadly. That's okay. She's a cute cat. I mean, like me, guys. Listen, you're talking to a 7 out of 7 BFD raider. Okay. If I had zero IQ, would we have cleared the raid? No way. All right. Yeah, I gotta go back to the raid because I gotta get the boots. Back to the raid? Yeah. It's like you gotta loot this like turtle thingy which i did and i gotta go to ratchet and like hand in some materials and then go back to the raid i guess we're more that needs to do that so yeah i don't want to do a mid run because like then you guys want to summon me and stuff because i have to fly to ratchet and that takes forever i guess That's we all have to do it i have no idea why your hand does it i mean you guys could know. do this now actually I don't all know. you need I, to I do is like buy a potion and then go to a certain spot in uh, Ashenvale right before BFD and then you drink it, you talk to the NPC, then you go inside the raid and you can like loot the scale that I have. This is the part I'm at. I'll link it in raid chat. Um, and then you gotta go ratchet. And that thing is at the turtle, the big turtle boss. So yeah, it's not like you, you can't do it anymore. Uh, that's what the white touched thing, right? Exactly, yeah. Yeah. Mm, okay, so that's what you prepare uh, like today? Or? As far as like Dini's been pre prepare been preparing a lot of things today. <laughs> I mean, that's what he was doing. Before. This guy tried to yeah. scam me so five gold, bro. Dude, okay. nice try, nice try. Nice uh, the potion, I uh, right regret on the auction house. There shouldn't be anything else called that. Sorry, wrong customer. <laughs> Very funny. Okay, listen, I don't buy gold, guys. All right. Move must be for the I busted my ass for this gold, dude. I was shredding the shredders, bro. Oh. Honestly, that is a fun gold farm. I have to admit. The stone talent thing. We had like a 42 shredder session with zero deaths. I still can't believe it. Somehow didn't die a single time. And even if you do die, it's a, it's a pretty fast corpse run. It ain't that bad. Yeah, there's one. So this is an iron forge. This is in Darnassus. Should I even hand it in? This could be a quest worth saving. Um, this one I will hand in an Iron Forge, and then this one is also okay, Darnassus well. for the second. Thanks, Rick. I'm off. Now. Oh, I, I don't want to do GDKP on this character. Right I don't yeah, mind if my gear sucks when the next phase comes out. I'm gonna oh. enjoy the game this way. It's gonna be a slower way of getting gear. Yep. <laughs> um, but every time I get an item, it's gonna be more meaningful, I guess. And the content is so ridiculously easy that it doesn't matter if I do 100 I'm, DPS I'm gonna, or 150 uh, DPS. Play, yeah. Yeah. Doesn't matter how much gear I have, I'm gonna lose to the hunter pet, so I'm, I'm not gonna stress about it, right? It would only matter for like doing PvP and stuff. They're wholesome. They they, they gave I me a spot without knowing who I was, you know, I didn't drop the streamer the card. Ring. Um they they basically gave a chance at me of, of a mage healer. You know, when no one else was willing to give it, so I, I appreciated that, man. Nah, that's just they don't know. Um, so I get to uh, whisper uh, by a lot of people to join the guild and I thought if we're making like a social uh, group or something that we just give no uh... <laughs> yeah I I'm thinking about what to do with that wait you mean you give them no loot no no they yeah, added like uh, you know I'm thinking about whether or not we invite them to the guild or not like what yeah I mean it's up to you dude like you know there's probably people that are spurgs and you know I don't care kind of community guys are right like but you can give people a chance and then if they're cool, like they're cool, right? And you just like, kick them to the curb and they're gonna like spam kick W, you know, like, or like be annoying, you know? Yeah, yeah. They're I'm sure there's like actual, like around. decent humans that are trying to join, right? Sorry, chat, but like, I don't know if it's, a, you know, some yeah, people just like. The social rank then. <laughs> uh... <laughs> social rank. <laughs> that was so bad. Oh my god. <laughs> Spurg rank. Oh my god, dude. I mean, I was gonna make my own guild, but I'm so lazy, dude. Like, I CBA, bro. Imagine trying to make a raid when I have my own guild. There's like 50 people that want to raid with me, and then we can only raid as 10 people. Like, I just can't imagine all the shit going on. Like, you can't even play with everyone. Like, just 10 people. Like, even today, we made World PvP. It's like 100 people. 
trying to join like it's just 40 man make 10 characters i'm gonna make more characters right maybe on my alts i'll make a guild or something like and then just keep this character and this guild like that's part of what i'm gonna do no i just took in one healer don't that write this if you get accepted in the guild like joker stream enjoyer yep guilty careful just be cool just act normal guys like that's it that's all you gotta do act <laughs> fucking normal like <laughs> come on <laughs> come on bro so we got this quest by the way guys um and i believe it leads into a portal oh i got another word buff dude this is insane 20 percent move speed by the way blizzard thank you for fixing this of allowing word buffs to be obtained when we have the word buff already chrono boomed amazing change so before let's say onyxia buff right and I had 20 minutes on it. And I chrono boon it. Right? And then Onyxia buff drops again. I don't get it. Because I got it in the boon. You can't have one outside and one in the boon. To the... Thank god they fixed that bro. Yeah make them public. I want to get flamed by my stream. I'm just curious. <laughs> you think I got good logs? Balasto? What the fuck? Yeah. Zero parse on everything. After, but I mean, if, if people don't prioritize. Nah, that can't be right. I don't really, no. I'm not blaming anyone because like, <laughs> wait, wait. I just have done luck. So wait, dude, listen, that's done. obviously bugs. I'm going to set it up for next time. Or I, I know Fiong is, but he had an that's issue. That's obviously bugs. And he had to reload something with it. There's so no, there's no way. 0.0. 0. Yeah, 0. No, no, he's gone to bed. But you can no, it's 100. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but for zero arcane right. mages. Even, even if it's private, you shouldn't Wait, am I the only arcane mage that killed the boss? There's no way. That it's probably just bugged like because I played beams, arcane man. With the link. Yeah. Oh. I'm the worst arcane mage on the boss. So it actually is a zero parse. Oh my <laughs> god, dude. That's so embarrassing, nice bro. Too. But I was saving my mana for last phase. I wasn't trying, bro. Like, dude. Dude, 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 dude. dude. By the way, bro, man, like, Iron Fortress, the quest bro, thing. bro, that ain't right. That ain't right. So we actually That's got zero parts. Okay, I didn't get a zero on this. I'm in the middle. Number one. Hold on, Kevin. Number one. So I think it's the room. number one on this boss, guys. Look at that. Yeah, we got last place on that boss. Who cares? We got number one on this. Balasto. <laughs> I'll take a look. Yeah, no one plays <laughs> Uh, I don't know. Where she? Which? Oh, wait, that's the Murloc the boss. <laughs> We're dodging the Murlocs, dude. Oh, look yeah, at sure. this. How long will it take? Effect? I don't know. Yo, that's kind of poggers. Is Joker still in? Uh, what's up? Yeah. yeah. Wait, do you uh, want to do the pre -made? I talked to that. Nah, I think I'm gonna do the the chain and then like go sleep probably. I'm just I mean, I'm a bit tired having a long day at work. <laughs> yeah. I, I was hoping they would say yeah we get to you like and they just laughed they don't think it's work bro i've been like entertaining these spurs for like 13 hours man man can you believe i i'm the worst arcane mage in the world on the last boss but to be honest like that was our third pull and i didn't think we were gonna kill the boss and i just was playing it how do you say like i barely barely spent any mana on like the first phase is that possible i, I didn't even evo I didn't maximize my damage. I didn't think about how fucking fast the boss was gonna die in the, in the second phase. I, I it, of course, I could have done more damage. I just didn't do. I just saved all my mana and Evo for last phase in case we needed it, and we didn't need it. Starting badge. I will go badge soon. But before we go badge, we need to do this uh, quest. There's a quest chain to get these boots and turn them into epic boots. That's what I'm doing right now. What do you get from ranking? I actually don't know, but someone told me you can get a cloak with like a lot of stats on it, like four all stats. But I'm not, I'm not sure that's true. But yeah, I don't know exactly where this is, by the way. What does the best mage do? Maybe learn from that. The best mage has more spell power. There's nothing to learn. Mage has always been like that in classic. It's really simple to play. Um, and the more spell power you have, the more damage you do. That's just how it is. Something to it. It's the same in Wrath, honestly, yeah. Yeah, or you crit more, that's true. I, I always make this, uh, tell the people the story. Uh, in, uh, in in Blackwing Lair, there was a Chinese mage who crit every single Frostbolt on Razor Gore. No one ever beat him. He always did the most DPS. He crit every Frostbolt. 
And I boss died in like 20 seconds, right? Which is the most DPS, which is great for Frostbolt. So yeah, after you get all the best gear, then you just gotta crit more than everyone else. Wait, can I keep this trinket? Goddess, watch over. Got all the mats she wants. May the stars guide you. Yo, that's an upgrade, boys. Plus five spirit. I'll take that, man. That's cool. I hope that doesn't get removed, though. So now I'm gonna head back to the raid. And uh, at that part where, like, there's a, a bunch of fog and it kills you, this won't kill you anymore because you have this trinket. Okay, that mob is bugged or something. Yo, I gotta swim fast, though, yeah? Of course, I'm gonna do this clam, though. Just in case I get a pearl. Six gold right there. Hey, hey, hey. Another clam. There's the chest, boys. Yo, I gotta hurry, dude. The box. We just found the box. Touching the box with your bare hands immediately fills you with a sense of deep disquisite. But also a sense of creative inspiration like you've never felt before. Requires a powerful source of the light. So I believe we need to go to Alterac Mountains, right? Yeah. Oh, Hillsbred. Gotta go Hillsbred, boys. Nah, Hillsbred, I think. But we go Ironforge because it's closer, right? How lucky it is to find a pearl like that, though. Dude, this is kind of complicated, boys. Like, we need to go to some secret area. Like, this is very well hidden. It's like all the way up here. Hey. Feral Druid, dude. Is that the stupid one or the smart one? That's the stupid one. She's called AV. She has zero uh, IQ. Sadly. That's okay. She's a cute cat. I mean, like me, guys. Listen, you're talking to a 7 out of 7 BFD raider. Okay. If I had zero IQ, would we have cleared the raid? No way. All right. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, you're about to watch something amazing. We are going to get an epic item at level 25 yes after obtaining the box we need to attempt to uh, use a powerful source of light to destroy it upon destroying the box something will be found inside the box what will be found inside the box so you're telling me at level 60 we're gonna go back to bfd on our alts that can receive the quest so we get this buff like i mean this is crazy like it's two percent crit 20 attack powers whatever but like 20 percent move speed is gonna be really good that's a sansa so while dropping all world buffs we have to go teleport darnassus from mage oh that's nice you go darnassus songflower ah it's all right it's all right so the game doesn't give you tips for finding stuff i mean i don't know how people found this out like, this is really well hidden, yeah? But people found out about these boots yesterday. These epic boots were first crafted yesterday. Was this even here before? This, like, part of the map. Shard of pure light. Now we can destroy the box. Shard of the Void. All that remains of the box is a tiny sliver of perfectly black crystal. It seemed it seems to draw in and consume the light. Oh, shadowy figure. The shifting cloud of shadows appears before you in a vaguely humanoid outline. While it's difficult to make out specific features, you get the distinct impression that this creature is smirking at you. So, you were able to destroy it after all. How boring. Who are you and what do you want? Don't worry about who I am. Consider instead that I can do what I can do for you. I'm quite sure I don't want anything from whatever it is you are. Don't you? I wouldn't be so sure. That bubble you have there 
A little black crystal. It's something special. I should do like voices. Um, something that shouldn't be wasted sitting at the bottom of your pack, along with bloody rags and crumbs of stale bread. I can't tell you how to use it. How to harness it. This would be destroyed, not used. People have died for this. Being entitled boring again. I'm starting to think that maybe this wasn't such a good idea. Fine. Do as you will. Cast into the fires of Blackrock. Cast it into the fires of Blackrock or deep into the maelstrom. Make sure it's thoroughly lost. You see though, these things don't tend to stay lost forever. Your point? I can't do the voice. It's, it's too long, guys. It's too long, alright? My point is that you don't know who's going to find it. I can think of no more stalwart, heroic, just and noble creature than yourself to bear it and take advantage of its gifts. I can show you a snap of the fingers and I can show you how to use it to make something truly special. You need only to say the word. Fine. Show me. You have learned how to create a new item. Those are pretty good. Yeah. That's why these spider silk boots are expensive, guys. Momentarily enter another plane of existence, instantly reducing threat as well as reducing all damage taken and damage dealt by 30% for 6 seconds. That can be really good in PvP as well. Like you're trying to stay alive from people attacking you? Yeah, 1% spell hit and 7 spell power. They look pretty good. Look at that. Let's use them actually. Damn, you actually become like uh, see through. Cool, cool, cool. There it is, boys. Finally, we have one good item, dude. But again, if you want to get these, you saw the whole quest chain, right? Um, it does cost a decent amount of gold. Um, the boots themselves are pretty much two pearls. You have to be a tailor, by the way. Um, at least 100 tailoring. That's all you need. Uh, 100 tailoring. Uh, to even be able to start a quest chain. You can't start a quest chain but without having 100 tailoring or 100 leather working. Or a hundred blacksmithing. You just can't start it. Um, uh, here's the trinkets. You get this trinket doing the question. I don't have a necklace, man. Like, what do you guys want me to do? I mean, if I farm Warsong rep, I'll get one neck. Right? I think it's honored. No, friendly. No, I, it's honored, actually. Ugh. It's only two stamina, anyway. Did I discover this all on my own? Yes, I discovered this question completely. Um, I definitely did not have Wowhead on the second monitor. Um, it's called Season of Discovery, right? Of course I discovered it. I'm not going to spoil it, you know. Go sleep or go wash. I'm going to go sleep. But uh, pretty good day, though. We got all the runes. We got the boots. Got to raid again. Finally have some gold. 